Hey, all right, hey boys, so watch. Hey boys, watch. Here's the rules, right? So it's a little hand fight sumo drill, okay? Where we're hey, we're fighting for the middle. Hey guys, listen. Hey guys, listen. Hey guys, listen. Hey, look. So basically, what we're trying to do with our short arms and pressure is just get the other guy out of the circle. All right. So the way we win, we get both feet out of the circle. I can punch the underhooks, shove them out. I could, you know, we could be wrestling here, and maybe he's pressuring me, and I could snap his hands to the mat. If I get his hands to the mat, he loses. If I get his feet out, he loses. Hands and knees. Okay. One foot, hands and knees, and then one foot out, you're out. No, two feet. One foot. He said no. Why would you nope. do two feet? Why would you like two? When you, when you go out, because they're going to throw him so out. He's going to throw him. Whatever. I'm trying to keep that with you. You lost. 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 You 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 when you're doing this, listen, think about, hey guys, listen, listen, all kidding aside, right? Here's what you should be, what, even though we're doing this kind of like a world, like a game, hey guys, hey guys, listen to me, all right? Think about when you're going to wrestle. Think about when we're, when we're, when we're close to the gap, when we tie up, right? And we talk about creating pressure, right? Or snapping the guy, or steering him like this, right? We're pushing, then we might we might feel him leaning in, and I can circle hard. All right, I just created a setup, right? I can release, he comes up, now I penetrate. I can get the weight shifted over a foot, right? Hey, we're we're working on maybe we're in here, we're, and we're and I really feel pressure from this guy, right? I could I could potentially do a little jab step snap down. Look, he's underneath me. Bam! There's a there's one attack. So even though we're doing this as a game, it's a little game, I want you to think about how you can improve your wrestling, your hand fighting, all right, your, your position. Hey, how do you avoid getting snapped out of your hands? What do you have to feel? Pressure. Okay, pressure what though? Pressure change, okay? So, um, for example, watch. If, if I have inside position on Ryan, and I'm, and I'm pressuring Ryan with small steps, and I feel Ryan begin to snap my hands off, I don't go down to my hands. I don't snap me. Oh, God, not going there. I'm pressuring, I feel him snap me, boop, right here. Now I'm back into it. That's the stuff I want you working on, okay? All right, who's the next two guys? Okay. All right, ready? Go ahead, yo. Make sure you're working out position. Go. Yes, sir. Wow. Hey, that's, 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 that's why it should be two feet. Yeah. Hey, listen. You're either, you're, if, you're, if your hands touch the mat or your feet are out, you're out. All right? Hey, guys, keep it simple. Hand fighting pressure and snaps. Snapping, circling, applying pressure, snapping. Certainly, applying, applying pressure, right? I'm not even, I don't even want you guys to get into the whole like, oh, you're trying to do a throw. Okay, I'm not worried about that. Warm up position, okay? All right, go ahead, go.
job of. He was active, right? So Gavin was taller, right? And Gavin was, was a high pressure. And what did Marcus do a good job of? And did you also notice too, he kept his, his uh, lead leg in the what? What is this in the middle of the what? Yeah, right? You want to be in the middle. Boom, circle, then you can pressure it out. Okay? That was a good example. Both guys did good, right? The smaller guy, A, was thinking about, man, I'm not, I choose, I'm small. So how can I even this up? He moved more, he was active, right? He just didn't stand his ground and get pushed out. Right? You gotta be thinking like that. Go ahead, go. Oh, here you go, you gotta stay low. Gotta stay low. All right, play it, go. Oh, oh, go. I don't know. Hey, Ty, do it again. He went out, but you hit your hands in. Yeah. Try to stay up. Try to stay up. Position. Oh, oh nice hard hands. Now listen, one hand seems kind of corny. Oh, that's stupid. Hands hard like hands. That. You like, hard. like, hey. The whole thing is, I want you guys learning when you're in here and you're pressuring, the guy snaps you just like this. It's like if I go, oh, and I'm here, now the guy may be a front head, he may run to a leg, or worse, what if I fall down low, oh, like this. Okay, so being able to know if I feel placing, right? You know, you're, you're, you're not understanding. Slap your hands and go. No. Oh, you know, circle. Oh, circle. Oh. <laughs> hey, what, hey, what happened to Wheaton? Where did his elbows go? What happened to him? He got double underhooked, right? So listen, right? Like, right in here. Hey, the, the farther, hey, our team, you guys are getting better with your tie-ups. You have to be able to keep in mind, the farther your elbows get away from your body, there's windows. Hey, you can pull to a two-on-one. You can post, right? We gotta be able to pull. Hey, look, even if our arms are extended, you should be pulling down. You should be creating this all the time. Pulling down. And, hey, if you're like, if you're trying to get your tie and the guy's making space, you can't get where you want to be, just reset. You guys chase that too much, and now you're out of your stance. You gave up ground, you gave up position, okay? Go ahead, slap it as you go. Stay in position. Go, you go, you go. Oh, oh I don't know what you're going to do. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, one foot. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Now, but listen. Hey, but that was that was a great example. Did you did you see how they like? You see the position? That's good stuff. I only took. Okay. One. You are out. You I'm are really, out. I'm like this. I'm like this. You well, have my got pushed out. out. <laughs> you got you pushed out. I follow the rules. Ready? Go ahead, go. Well, go you ahead, go. Stupid rules are easy to think about. Stupid, stupid. You're, you're, a stupid you're a stupid rule maker. There you go. No, Work out. There you go. Small steps of pressure. Oh, God. Oh. 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 That's oh. Hey, hey, how many? What do we got here? How many circles? We got AJ's four. Only on Hey, so let's spread out. Uh, <laughs> well, we got squares too. Hey, here's what I want to do. Get a partner, get a guy. Let's do a little bit of this. We're working now, we're hand fighting here. I want you to clear tie ups, try to get under hooks. We got one more guy. Oh, do we? Yeah. Oh, I'm on the outside. I thought we were done. I thought we were done. I, I didn't know, I forgot. Go ahead, go. My bad. I'm glad you caught. Stay in the middle. Oh, no, no, no. All right, let me hey, see what happens though. You see what can happen if you over wrestle, right? That can be a good little drill. Hey, we're, we're, we're learning awareness. Hey, how to not overreact, over wrestle, right? Okay, a lot of that is a lot of what you guys are getting better at is you're getting better at reacting when you get put in a little a situation. You have to be able to react and wrestle. Whether you're in a front headlock, whether you have a front headlock on your opponent, whether we're on bottom or we're on top, whether I'm shooting or he's shooting on me, I we have to be able to wrestle and 
every situation that we're in and keep working. Just keep working. All right? We used to have a bad habit of getting caught early. Remember last year during the year at high school? I would bitch and rant about we get caught underneath the front headlock and let the guy bang our head down and spin around. If you're fighting through that now, that's effort. All that is is this effort and, uh, and uh, focus. Effort and focus, not letting the guy get around. Right? Getting out of the front headlock and getting back to where we can wrestle. You guys did a better job of that. And those little scenarios like that, all the way throughout the go of the match, that's how you get tough, that's how you get better. All right? Does that make sense? Okay. So, my bad, I didn't mean to skip the A game. Let's do this. Find a square 